Welcome back to Whiskey With E, I'm Eric. Now today, not a whiskey with or without the E, but we have a craft beer review. Well, it's not really craft beer, but it is something different. I have never tried a fruit lager before until I got this six pack. Now, this is a passion fruit mango fruit lager coming out of Byron Bay Brewery. Look at that, the bees make up the pine tree. All right, so let's have a little read. Um, beer made with fruit juice and natural flavors may contain vi visible sediment. Um, born in Byron Bay for bottling, the beer is brewed outside of Byron Bay. And now that just confused me. Beer brewed and bottled around Australia in carbon neutral breweries buy or under license from byron bay brewery part of the lion group all right now that all that's out of the way <laughs> oh my goodness let's just get right into the beer oh my goodness where's the glass at we don't even have our glass right here but you know what i guess i better um go grab the glass hold on let me just teleport the glass over here <clears throat> hold on And there we go. We got the glass. Alrighty, so 4% alcohol per volume, which is only 1.1 standard drinks. Let's get that, Craig. Look at that. Alrighties. Colour, very bright, light, and fruity looking. Let's just aggressive pour it. Bam. Aggressive pour. Look at that. Carbonation, rushing, oh my goodness, I could smell that tropical passion fruit and mango vibes from here. Look at that, one finger and a bit, carbonation head, fluffy white head, carbonation, look at all that bubbles on the side, you can notice. You can see through that, so it's not a hazy or anything, but let's give it a nose. Yep, like I said, this is just passion fruit and mangoes so just picture grabbing a passion like a like a mango or passion fruit kind of um soft drink or that sparkling water flavored mango kind of thing that's what you're getting on the nose so you're not getting any beer vibes out of this at all so let's see how it goes on the on the taste but anyways Who's trying to let me know in the comments? Drink responsibly. I mean, this would be probably perfect for the summertime. So if you're in summer, remember to grab this. All right, here we go. First sip, let's go. Cheers, everyone. That is just easy drinking. That is just refreshing. That is just like having uh, like a passion fruit or like a, a mango, bit of a soft drink mixed in with um, like a lager, but you're barely tasting the lager, the beer flavors. I mean, this would definitely be a good girls type drink, not trying to be racial or not gender stereotyping or anything, but... um. This is just like one of those fruity style of beers that I think boys would probably not want to drink this. I don't know. Maybe it's maybe it's too fruity. You, you might think like, ah, where's the beer flavor? So this is on the fruity end. So you, the tropical fruits, that mangoes, the passion fruits, that's just all coming in. Let's just go for a second one. But technically refreshing very easy drinking it is just four percent but i don't mind this technically i think this would be great in the summer like i've been saying but let's go for the second sip cheers all right so it almost comes across like you're drinking a cider like a like a pear or a kind of apple kind of cider but in mango flavor if that makes sense 
with some hints of that passion fruit in there. You know what, this is just an easy drinking beer, but it just doesn't have the beer flavors. But this is just my first fruit lager I've ever tried, so maybe this is what a fruit lager is. They're adding in some fruit into a lager. There you go. Hence why it tastes like you just added in some mango, tropical fruits into a beer and um, added in some bubbles. So hence why I've been saying probably like a tropical kind of um, mango flavored, you know, sparkling mineral water or soft drink mixed in with some beer. That's what it tastes like. But is it nice? Yes, it is nice. It's refreshing. I don't mind this. But I only got it because I was buying something and they're like, ah, oh, would you like to buy this for half price? So there you go. Can't even remember what I paid, but there you go. Comes in a 355ml bottle. Package looks like so. But it's not bad. Easy drinking. But I did give this to someone to try. And even he said that, uh, yeah, maybe it's too fruity for him. So that's a man style of man and he would probably rather prefer your standard lagers or your drafts or, you know, so this definitely would not be for the pub goers that want a beer on tap. But for you ladies out there that uh, don't want to drink something that has too much beer flavors, that bitter beer vibes, then this would probably be for you. But anyways, I'm going to have another sip, but uh, cheers everyone. And that sounds like a vacuum. Hmm. Can you guys hear a vacuum? <laughs> Anyways, I guess the vacuum is our cue to say like, comment, subscribe. See, it's starting to go a little bit flat. The more you drink it, the more of that carbonation starting to go. But it is an easy drinking beer. I mean, I just recommend this in the summer, I'd say. But anyways, let me know if you've tried it. And uh, I'll catch you all next time. Next review, we are going to get back into the stout vibes. And since it is July and we're not on dry July, we're going to do dry July. So, we're going to try Master's Keep. I've been holding off for a long time. I think I'm going to try it. Maybe we'll grab a few rise as well to try. Hard for me to pull the trigger on rise sometimes. But anyways, we're getting off topic. We're here, we're here to focus on this. And um, now that that's over, I'm just going to have another sip. Wish you all a good day, good night while the vacuum's going. And um, I'll catch you all next time. Cheers, everyone. Alrighty guys, oh, yeah. do you want to see vacuum? I think it is a vacuum sound. Oh. Oh. Just stopped. Alrighties, I'm out of here. <laughs> Cheers all. Definitely very refreshing, very sweet, just fruit, fruity. I mean, I want to say a hint of beer, but there's barely even no beer in this. It's like you're just drinking a mango juice that has bubbles that resembles a beer. Anyways, cheers all. Catch you all next time. Mm. The color, mm, very easy drinking. Anywho, all right, I'm out of here. Repeating myself, peace. All.